With a picture of the governor of the Bank of Ghana on his phone, this artist studies his facial contours for a live painting at one of Ghana's prestigious events, the Banking Awards, at 12 p.m. He needs less than six hours to prepare for that. He looks at it, memorizes, makes hand gestures on how he will move the brush and the speed with which he will need to paint the governor. Meet Isaac Chukwede, the 18-year-old painter who paints upside down. Chuku picked his talent from his mother and within a space of 10 minutes, he paints at various events. When we met Isaac Chukwede at home, we first asked him what it will require to paint someone upside down. As an artist, everybody has his or her ways. So then my ways is when I, when I pick up the image, I, I have the original copy and I change the image to black and white. So then whilst, whilst I'm learning it, I zoom in and out to see where I'll get more of white and more of black. So then when I zoom in, it gives me the silhouette um, style I want. So then that's how I go. So it takes me sometimes a day or two to study an image. So then I study it upside down on my phone. Isaac Chukwede adds how he takes solace in painting since he's not academically good. Anytime I go to school, because I wasn't a good student, I was always close to my art teacher, which was Sir Jesslev, Auntie Sophia and Sir Tompo. And I really respect them for that. I sometimes go to their houses. I sit there during the weekends when I don't have anything doing. When they have jobs, they send me around with them. Anywhere they go, they send me around. If it's, if it's arts based, they send me anywhere they go. So then they always tell me, although we are sending you and not doing anything, make sure you watch and learn. He worries how other talented students are written off by the academic system. So we put him to the test. Up and down the brush went, and in 10 minutes, he was done. This is the original picture and his painting. Living with his grandmother, he hopes to make enough money to take care of her and the extended family. It's helping my family a lot, both my, my nuclear family and my extended family. Sometimes my cousins and everyone around me are proud if um, they ask me, oh Chuku, I want you to help me with something, I'm able to give them something, they're happy. Although the money is not coming, but it's, we are managing. Painting on stage, he charges $250, and when he does it at home, the piece goes for $125. Joyce Ayoko is his grandmother, and she's hopeful her grandson will go international owing to his diligence. She recalls his actions when he has an event. A war, yes, a war. Down in Mimbro, who wasting electricity, who waste electricity, and then they were happy. Oh, ma, ma, boy, boy. It's easy. Now, our wife is gone. Our wife is gone. My people, but it's like we are some light man. He draw. They know he paints, they know who he be. If it takes him, I think. Chuku seems to be bringing a different twist to events in Ghana by painting to spice the map, which is unusual. A budding, talented artist, 18 years. Not only does he paint upside down, Chuku also does uh, the puzzle painting. So this one that I'm actually doing here is actually the crown of Jesus Christ, the thorny crown of Jesus Christ. And then he will add three other pieces. He does this also painting it upside down. Well, interesting painting, um, even as he hopes to become one of the biggest artists in uh, the country. Well, from Accra, Ghana, Odilian Tiamwa Bwampong for Africa News.